Hu Tao is one of my oldest characters and is part of my most used team. With Arlequino coming out soon, a lot of people are already hyping her up, calling her the better Hu Tao, and that slander cannot stand. But I haven't upgraded Hu Tao in forever, so today that changes. Alright, so now that Hu Tao has her Staff of Homa and his Triple Crown, it's time to reevaluate her build. She's been stuck on deathmatch artifacts for months now. So here's her artifacts and her stats. Right off the bat, you can see she has 0 EM and 50% crit rate. Deathmatch is a crit rate weapon, so I gave her crit damage heavy artifacts to balance her ratio, but that was a long time ago. So my new goal is for Hu Tao to eventually have a 75 to 200 crit ratio with 200 EM. Before I start making changes, I want to see what a charged vape attack looks like right now. So I'm just gonna beat up Masanori really quick. My game sound broke for some reason, so I'm sorry about that, but as you'll see, I missed the crit three out of five times. The two crits I do hit do 71 and 80k damage respectfully, which averages out to about 72k damage per crit. But with that baseline in mind, it's time to head over to the strong box. I haven't actually gambled, I mean strongboxed, since I built my Eula, so I'm sure this will be a lot of fun. Okay, nothing good in batch one. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe. Oh ho ho! Alright, let's roll that. Because if that rolls well, that is the piece of the century right there. Okay, so the worst thing this could do is roll into flat defense, but the best thing it could do is roll into percent HP, and then only into crit rate. Come on, give me something good. Oh, don't be like this. Please don't do what I think you're about to do. Okay. No! Please, it's such a good piece. Don't do this to me. Not like this. Not like this. Alright, and it's a dead piece. That is a fucking shame. You know what? I'm 20ing it. Might as well. What's the worst that could happen? It rolls flat defense? Oh. I actually don't know if I'm comfortable losing 8k HP just for a little more crit and EM, but I would like to see if the EM is comparable in damage, since I'd lose HP attack and crit damage for it. Could you stop blocking? I'm trying to test damage here, Masanori. Wait, you can kill Masanori? I actually had no idea. He's been out three years and I've never killed him. Unfortunately, I only crit twice again and somehow missed four, even with more crit rate. But you can see the average damage went up to 82k, which is a pretty good increase. I actually thought losing the HP and attack stats would lower my damage, but that's clearly not true. Here's a look at Hu Tao in her Parmita Papilio state with both sands side by side. You can see that she actually only ends up losing about 200 attack with the EM goblet, which is why the damage is higher. Now I can't lie, the higher damage looks really nice but I'm still unsure if I'm comfortable playing such a squishy Hu Tao. So I'm gonna strongbox some more and try to get another onset HP goblet and hope this one gets crit rate in EM. That's a lot of circlets. Wow, that is unfortunate to see. I'm sure somebody could use that. The best thing this could possibly be is a four stat HP goblet with EM, double crit and percent attack. It technically does have HP and attack. All these pieces suck. Literally not one rollable piece. Wait a minute, that's three crit rate circlets in a row. This one could actually be really, really good. I'll roll that one. All right, well, maybe I could upgrade her circlet. I wasn't planning on it, but it couldn't hurt to try and get a better one. That piece is trash. It will be my fodder. There is not a person alive who would use that. Yes, please. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Sheesh. This is probably Hu Tao's new circlet. Even if this rolls flat defense here, it's gonna be her new circlet. I can guarantee that. Oh, shit! Okay! Now, the only thing that sucks is she's gonna be real squishy. But that is 
quite the artifact. That is a huge crit damage buff. Now the only thing I really, really hate is how low her HP is. I'm gonna need to rebalance her HP. This is the next- whoa. Wait, why is this on set 26 crit damage piece not on Hu Tao? Wait, it's not even locked? Actually, the new circlet dropped a lot of HP for crit damage, so... Honestly, I'm not even gonna bother using this piece. 26k HP is quite low. Anyway, I was going to say the next upgrade to make is the flower. Ideally, I want a flower with high crit rate and some EM. Well, this piece has crit rate and EM, so I'll try upgrading it a little bit more. Ah, but 2.7 is literally the lowest possible stat roll. Ah, fuck it. Okay, 6% is a little better. That's a lot of HP. Let me compare this. What's the trade-off? I gain more HP, which is what I want. I lose attack, that's probably fine. I trade 6 crit damage for 6 crit rate plus EM, which is better. Yeah, I think this is the better piece. So now Huto has 219 EM, 28k HP, 1200 attack, and a very good crit ratio of 68 to 222. It's not exactly the 75 crit rate I wanted, but I've only done a couple strong boxes, so I can't complain. I would really like to have more HP, but I guess when she's on the team, she has 32k, which is pretty good. She had about 38k beforehand, so this isn't too much of a drop. I also only lose about 200 attack in my skill for an extra 200 EM, so I think this is probably the best trade-off. Hey, I heard you're pretty strong. Let's fight. I mean... Realistically, the damage looks exactly the same as it did beforehand, but I like the stat line and it seems like I was critting more consistently, so I think this will be my final build today. 68% crit rate, 220% crit damage, 219 EM, 32,000 H, well, 27,000 HP because she's double buffed by Hydro. It's pretty good. That won't ever change. Yeah, sometimes I'm mad, sometimes I'm okay. Yeah, I know I'll have what I want someday. I need my space now so I can feel nothing. I live this nightmare so I